This is where copywriting is about to be and this is where it is right now. So in this video, I'm gonna explain how you can get in before this rise and make a lot of money. So how do I know this? Well, I've made over a million dollars as a copywriter and worked with some of the biggest companies in the world and I have an inside scoop on what's about to happen. Let's get into it. So copywriting has been around for a few years now, but there's something that's about to happen which will help specifically beginner copywriters make a lot more money. Because this change right here is related to a completely new form of copywriting that we've literally never seen before. It's something you definitely won't find in any course or book or YouTube video from another copywriter because 99% of people have never heard of it before. So what is this new form of copywriting? Well, for the last four years, we've seen the rise of digital creators starting to make money and make a living off of their video content. Now, before that, it was definitely possible that you could make money from making videos online, but it was extremely uncommon because you had to be someone who's extremely charismatic like Logan Paul or KSI, or you had to be extremely attractive and have a big fat ass if you wanted to get views on Instagram. But things have changed now, and 99% of people haven't caught on to it yet, which is why we are here. When I was about 19, I wanted to make money online, and I stumbled across something called copywriting. So I was doing that for a couple of months and started to make a decent income from it. Until I realized that I was a lot more passionate about creating video content and I wanted to make a living doing that instead of just copywriting. And now I'm gonna drop some serious value but I wanna preface it by saying you will not have to make any video content or ever record yourself to do what I'm about to teach you here. But anyway, I decided I was going to start uploading videos of myself, talking about things that I was interested in at the time, and I would do it on TikTok. And I decided that I was going to make a video every single day and then just see where it went. And after a couple of weeks, I actually had my first viral video. Now, it didn't get 20 million views, but for me, it was pretty viral because within a couple of days of this video being up, it got about 400,000 views and almost everyone I knew in my personal life had seen the video because it promoted it by region or something. I was really blown away by this at the time and I started getting a lot of people asking me sort of, how do you get into making videos or how do you know what to make videos about? And one of the guys who was messaging me at the time who really wanted to start making videos was a guy I was really good friends with in school and he wanted to start making fitness videos. Now, he didn't have a big fat ass and he certainly wasn't animated whenever he got on camera. He just wanted to explain things about fitness that people didn't know. And so over the next year or so, we had both built our own TikTok pages and we were doing quite well. I had gotten my page to about 500K followers. Then I decided that TikTok wasn't for me and I wanted to work on other businesses and try new things. But I had learned an absolute shit ton from my time of doing TikTok about how to get people's attention keep their attention and then drive them to take a certain action. And so in the first year or two, I was working with clients like Panasonic, Warner Brothers, Burger King, and even TikTok themselves on some of their ad campaigns. Meanwhile, when I was quitting TikTok, Sean was really enjoying making fitness content and he kept doing it, he doubled down. And I think that he realized the same thing as me back then. You don't have to be fake and crazy on camera in order to get attention. You just have to be interesting and deliver things in an interesting way. You also need to understand how to retain people's attention with proper scripting in your videos. And if you look for Sean now, you'll see that he has millions of followers on every platform. He's traveled the world. He's built some absolutely fantastic businesses and it was all driven by his video content. Now in that time, you would think that Sean, who's gone from zero to millions of followers on all these platforms, went from making iPhone videos to big cinematic productions. But in fact, if you look at Sean's pages, you'll see that he still uploads every single video on his iPhone and he just talks in the same way as he did back then. So this is where your opportunity comes in. If we wanna look at the key components of what makes a video go viral, especially if it's one where someone's explaining something or teaching something or just talking, I can tell you from experience and from, you can see on Sean's channel, it's not about crazy editing or massive cinematic production. Sean just makes simple explainer videos talking about fitness topics that a large number of people are interested in and he delivers it in a funny and interesting way every time. The most important component of Sean's videos that drive hundreds of millions of views for him with just the most simple videos is his script. So the opportunity I'm talking about today that you can use 
is writing video scripts for creators. What Sean does with his videos is something that I've seen hundreds of people try and recreate. There are so many influencers and content creators who just straight up copy his videos word for word but they all fail because none of them understand the key principles of scripting and how to actually keep people's attention. So your opportunity as a beginner copywriter here is to start understanding a platform like TikTok, Instagram Reels, or even long form YouTube content and figure out what makes a good script in whatever niche that you wanna work in. If you decide on a niche or a group of people that you can really connect with and that you would be interested in working with, you can focus on being the absolute best script writer in that niche and work with some of the top influencers that you see there. And if you're not sure on what niche you should pick, just imagine you were making the videos yourself. If you could make videos about anything in the world or be creative about anything in the world, what would it be? I can tell you that the best industries with the most amount of money for beginners are fitness, money, and relationships. These are simply the biggest markets. Everybody wants to get fitter and healthier. Everybody wants to make more money and everybody wants to have better relationships. Now, when you're starting, you can get paid per script that you write for these guys and then get yourself a couple of case studies. So what I mean by case studies is, let's say you write 10 videos for a guy and one of those videos goes viral and gets a million views. You now have a case study for your copywriting website or whatever that says, hey, I write scripts and here's one that got a million views. Then once you've got a few case studies like this and you can prove that you're actually a good script writer, you can start to charge in retainers, which means you charge a thousand, two thousand dollars a month to work with different creators. And by getting videos that hit like a million views or more, you're starting to validate your own skills as a script writer. You start to understand that, oh, I'm actually good at this stuff because the stuff that I'm writing is getting a lot of attention, which is your big goal here. And if you get really, really good at this, you could even potentially take a revenue share from the creator that you're working with. It's definitely an opportunity if you find that you're absolutely amazing at what you do and you find somebody that really wants to keep you as their script writer. What's really important before you do any of this though is that you understand where you are now. So many beginners will watch this video and then think that they're an expert in script writing all of a sudden. They'll go off and write 10 practice scripts and think they have the authority to tell a creator how to make videos. But it's not that simple because the people that you wanna work with are creators, they're individuals. They have their own style and they have their own way of delivering their message. Just like any new venture you start, you will be pretty terrible at the beginning. So you just have to take some time, do a lot of practice and understand that you might have to give away your first scripts for free just to see how they perform. Now, if you're really lucky, you might find a creator that's already big and just wants someone to help them write scripts and they might even coach you, but this is very, very rare and I do not see it happening because as a creator, as someone who's made videos before, I get literally thousands of offers from people who want to do work for free and I just don't care because I know that it's gonna take up more of my time and cost me more than it's actually saving me. Now, full disclosure, I own a copywriting coaching company where we coach people to do exactly this. And if you're interested, you can get the link in the description, but you do have to apply and we only let a small amount of people in each month. It's not free, but it will absolutely accelerate the speed at which you progress at this stuff. People are literally crying out right now for good script writers that can make short form content or YouTube long form content or even ad creatives for their ad campaigns. But most script writers, just like most people who start any business, are incredibly lazy and they have high expectations of what they should be getting paid. So if doing this is something you're really serious about and you actually want to make money as a copywriter, you need to understand that you have to research each client and their market that you wanna work with. Luckily, I break that down in this video for beginners. Very simple, I'll see you there.